everyone. Welcome to your moment of mindfulness this week. Now, over the last five weeks, you've learned lots of techniques on how to be calm, how to control your breathing, and how to control your thinking. And today, for our very last moment of mindfulness, I want you to realise that you can use mindfulness to appreciate the world around us. For example, I'm sitting next to my beautiful tree, which is inside the rainbow room, and outside in the garden are beautiful trees and their blossoms on the trees and their little flowers showing their faces and spring is starting to appear. And if you go for a walk, just by concentrating on all those lovely things in nature, you can be using mindfulness to appreciate it. So I'm going to show you today how you can use mindfulness when you eat. You've never thought of that before, have you? So I've got a little bunch of grapes. It works really well with fruit. So if you like fruit or you like tomatoes or, or salad veg, you might want to try with that. And this is how we use mindfulness when we eat. So are you ready? So I've got my little bunch of grapes. I'm going to look at my grapes. I'm going to take one grape off. Here we go. Pick one grape. And I'm going to start off by looking at it very closely. So if I look very closely, as I look, I just calm myself down, just relax. I can see there's a tiny little place where the stalk went in, can you see? And I can see that the grape is round. And I can see all the different colours on the outside of the skin. I wonder what it smells like. Should I have a sniff? Mmm, smells quite nice. I can smell that it smells juicy and sweet. I wonder if I give it a little lick, a little taste. What if I hear anything if I put it to my ear? Can I hear anything? Tiny little squeak. I can listen to the grape before I eat it. And now's the fun part. I'm going to put it in my mouth and I'm going to close my eyes. And as I bite and chew and taste as the juices run round my tongue and my teeth chew up the grape and I really, really enjoy it, I'm going to be mindful. I'm going to be thinking about that experience of what it really tastes like. So I'm going to try it now. Are you ready? In my mouth. Oh. Mmm. Juicy. That was a lovely grape. And that time, instead of just going munch, 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 chew and swallow, when I bit it, I felt the juices come out. I felt that sweetness in my mouth. I felt a little bit of skin. And then I chewed a little bit more and then I swallowed. And I was very mindful of how I was eating. So you see how you can use mindfulness when you eat. You can use mindfulness when you go for a walk. You can lie on your tummy outside in the grass and look at all the little bees and all the little bugs and the little worms and the things that are in the soil. And you can be mindful of what you see. So not just doing those activities that we learnt that help you to be calm, but you can start to be mindful when you eat, start to be mindful when you look at things and when you use all your senses to experience the world around you. Okay, so use your mindfulness. You've got six different moments of mindfulness now. Choose the one that you like best and practice often. Okay, look after yourselves. Bye.